It's extraordinarily moving for me to have won the Goldman Rikisha Prize from the BBRF. I was Pat's postdoc, and I've based my entire life's work on hers. And she really transformed all of neuroscience. Science is really like a relay race and a treasure hunt combined. And Pat has passed the torch to us, and now we're trying to dig down and find why is it that the circuits she discovered are so particularly vulnerable in schizophrenia. My research is trying to understand how higher cognitive circuits in prefrontal cortex are regulated at the molecular level. One of the most exciting discoveries we have had is learning how stress impairs higher cognitive function. In my own lab, what we most hope to figure out is what is causing higher cognitive circuits to atrophy, why they fall apart with stress, why they fall apart in mental illness, how can we stop it. If we can figure out a medication to stop that, the hope is that we could give it to teenagers at high risk of schizophrenia and prevent them from actually descending into illness. The NARSAD grant funding has been absolutely critical. It's what you use to explore new ideas and the frontiers of your own research that NIH funding can't do. This award is not just for me, but all of us who work so closely with Pat and were so inspired by her. And it really feels like the Goldman Rikish Award has come home.